This is a basic training Halloween special. <laughs> My name is Anita Bergwanders. I'm senior beauty editor at Marie Claire and a big Halloween fan. I am here with Alice Bazaar, who is a makeup extraordinaire and special effects expert. Today we're going to be doing a Day of the Dead look. It's also known as the Sugar Skull. This is a really super quick look that you can do and wear with something like an evening dress for a Halloween party. Alice, can you talk us through what we're going to need and what we're going to use? Okay, for your base, you're going to have to have a good white paint. So I use Cryolin Supercolor, which is a grease paint, and it really sets. When you use it strong, it's really like prominent and white. And I set it with Ben 9 Neutral Set because it can work on any colour and stuff. Amazing. Um, for if you want a really strong colour, using a colour grease paint or cream paint again will make your colours stand out a lot more than just putting them onto white Amazing. as well. And then onto your colours, um, you can use any kind of eyeshadows. Really? I here's a little palette <laughs> I have. You can get these off eBay actually, quite cheap for about a tenner. And they're really good, especially on the cream paint because they stand out really well and they set really well. They set the paint as well. To add like little emphasis and little just little sparkly bits, we're gonna use some glitter. This is Stargazer's just glitter gels. They're really good for little dots. Um, you'll also need your black liquid eyeliner for any details or if you want to just darken your eyes as well. Are we gonna use lashes? We will be using lashes, yes. Um, make sure you have your eyelash glue. I use Duo because it's really good. You can get that in Boots actually and it's definitely the best eyelash glue I'd say use. You can use your eyelashes. If you find something more fun, like anything that you might see, again you can find them in fancy dress shops and stuff, Stargazer do them, Makeup Forever do them. But um, if you can find something a bit more theatrical then this is your chance to use it because Day of the Dead, Skulls, Sugar Skulls are all about carnival, they're all about celebration, they're all about being colourful. So, um, yeah, I think that's all we'll need to use for this. Amazing. So, firstly, we're going to do our base colours. This is going to be a cream or grease paint, whichever's best for you. We're going to use white for this look, as well as blue for the eyes and nose, and pink for the lips and cheekbones. Go over firstly with a neutral set powder just to set all the paint. Then, over each colour, go over with the eyeshadow of that colour. So for here we're doing blue for the blue eyes. This emphasises the colour you've already painted as well as helps set the paint itself. Using the same eyeshadow you can lightly outline where your teeth are going to be. Using darker shades of eyeshadow you can add a little bit more depth to the eyes and the cheekbones. Using a black liquid eyeliner we will do the details around the eyes, cheekbones, nose and mouth. Try not to worry so much about getting your teeth even and drawing perfect teeth. Giving a general look can give a more funky effect, even if you use different colours. Using the same white paint or a white liquid eyeliner or white eyeliner pencil, you can add extra detail to your look and extra depth if you use it against the black liquid eyeliner. Here I'm using Stargazer's Glitter Gel, but you can use any glitter you want. This gives an extra sparkle and a little extra carnival feel to your colourful skull makeup. And finally, we're going to add your eyelashes. When applying eyelash glue, tap it a little bit first to make it tacky, otherwise your eyelashes might just slide off your eye. So here's your Day of the Dead look. It's a more colourful way to keep spooky this Halloween for fans of anything carnival or maybe something just a bit girlier. Head to maryclaire.co.uk for more Halloween special videos.